Coming at you live on the uh, 19th, right? Yeah. Jeanette? All day. All day today. It's one of those special days where the date stays consistent throughout the 24-hour period. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing great. You look extra good today. Oh, well, thank you for noticing because <laughs> I worked extra hard. And you look extra tanned. Really? Yeah. yeah. I was up north. I know. It's nice. Fishing. Eh? Just enjoying the summer while we still can. So crazy, though. Everybody's complaining about the heat, right? Would they rather have minus 40? <laughs> Some people are now saying, you know, that's the thing. Yeah, I'd rather have minus 40. Of course, they're not going to feel the same way when it is minus 40, are they? No. You know what I complain about? Not so much the heat, uh, although being asthmatic, it does affect me, and sometimes I can't be outside all day. But, you know, in the evening when it cools off, it's better. I complain about the fact that it's half over, and I've hardly, I, I have enjoyed it, but I wished I had more time to enjoy it because it's such a short-lived season, and I'm still working every day, and, you know, I'm inside with air conditioning and uh, just using the weekends and the evenings to partake of the nice summer activities i know well that's the way it goes right <clears throat> but yeah you don't feel like working in the summer everybody should have actually i know that's true you should take time off to um you know rejuvenate yourself and and think about what's coming for fall but a bad problem that entrepreneurs have is that they t take too much time off in the summer and then the fall be is upon them and uh they don't know what to do. They're scramming, you know, like for business, for speaking gigs, for um, clients, for everything, really. So I encourage people to take a little time to at least do a marketing plan or do something to, about your marketing through the summer when it's kind of quieter and a downtime and when you're off at the cottage. You can do use your computer outside on the deck or by the pool or whatever, or right? Or take a notebook. Yeah. Forget about the computer for a while. I was up uh, where I was. It uh, was a very secluded lake. And, oh. uh, and uh, unfortunately, only on the last day did I find this perfect spot, a rock jutting out into the lake. Beautiful view. No other cottages or people in sight. Just the, uh, wow. the birds, the uh, fish, the, uh, the waves. And I just thought this would be great. Just hang out here with a notebook. Clear your mind. And then you can do some serious like strategic planning on you know, whatever it is you want to strategic. Yeah, a couple about. hours here and there. I'm not saying don't enjoy the summer. I'm saying, you know, to me that is time. enjoying the summer. Yes, it you is know? enjoying the summer. I'm saying don't, don't uh, think that you know working on your on your business a little bit is is going to interfere with joy enjoying the summer. It's just a good time to use the downtime to pre-plan for the next season. Exactly, and and we're going to give some people uh, or people some uh, great uh, ways to do that today, aren't we? Yes, we are. Because we've got, uh, of course, the magnetic marketing moment coming up in just a few minutes here. And uh, you, you're you bringing a special guest on uh, That's, today. That is true. It's not just going to be Jeanette, the magnetic, Jeanette, your marketing magnet on the magnetic marketing moment today. Today, our viewers are getting um, two marketing experts for the price of one. And um, I'm having my special guest and colleague, Mark Gordon of Forward Marketing, come and join me on the segment today. We are both going to give you the skinny, um, and of course you're going to help us here, on customer service and what an important marketing tool it is. Yet so many entrepreneurs forget about that and think, you know, I'll just slash the prices or, you know, offer a promotion or a discount and that's enough to keep my customers happy and satisfied and with me and spreading good word about my, my business and my products and services. Not so. So okay. we're going to talk about that today. We're going to talk about the eight things you can actually do to ensure that you have great customer service. And really, it's just such a simple, costless, costless marketing tool to do. And it's so important because, uh, you know, once you've got that relationship with your customer, you know, the hard, you know, now you've got great. Keep that relationship, you know, give excellent customer service. Keep that customer coming back. Right. And, and uh, you know, sadly, 
a lot of business people are more interested in chasing the new customer than servicing the old. For, and yeah. they don't realize how much that actually costs them. So we'll exactly. talk about that too. Okay. And then we're going to have um, David Grossman, who was part of the Mensch, uh, sorry, ran Mensch Life on that channel, part of the That Channel family for, for a long time. And uh, he is the host of Mench and creator of Mench Life TV. And we're going to talk about what it takes to host your own show every week and have a voice and be a host. And especially in the confines of Mench Life TV, which, um, you know, is, is a Jewish oriented program and has just been it's, it's airing on Jew, uh, JLTV, which is Jewish Life Television in the U.S. And um, recently, like a couple days ago, they just released a press release saying that JLTV is coming to Canada as part of the multicultural station. So it's really a, a great time for David to be here. Yeah, that's great. And, and then uh, we're going to have Tanya Cheranova in today. And uh, she's uh, a partner with Joanna Andros in Courageous Living. She's also a speaker, a coach, and, and a trainer. But she is well-versed with uh, her first um, business, which was um, beauty and aesthetics and anti-aging. And she was also on the shopping channel with a line called Time Reverse. So she's gonna be here talking about all the things we can do to make ourselves youthful and beautiful without undergoing the knife. Do you think she's gonna talk about the immortality rings? Well, present them to her. Maybe <laughs> she maybe she will. Maybe she'll surprise you. I think I might have t told her about it before. But okay, well, we'll see if that works. That might be another thing that we could use, you know, in addition to creams and storms. And I want to also mention that Tanya has a great giveaway today. She has a skincare giveaway consisting of cleanser, toner, um, and an anti wrinkle stick worth $85 to the first caller in. So we want to make sure that our callers get that. And should we wait until uh, yeah, she well, comes on before people call in? Yeah, we should. But I just want to mention that she has that coming okay. up. And uh, I also have a giveaway, which is a, a free 30-minute one-to-one marketing PR coaching assessment with me, valued at, a, at $150 for people to call in and win. And then later in the That's show... That's worth the price, uh, just even if you don't even teach them anything, Jeanette. Just one to, thing. For people to spend an hour, half an hour with you, that's... Oh, That's you're worth so 150 sweet. bucks. You're so sweet. Uh, thanks. And and then we have a very another special guest coming in, by the name of um, Lao Ping, who also is known as Apple Blossom, and she's doing a really cool thing. She has a site called Dare to Dream, and what she does is, uh, she really helps people facilitate their dreams and bring them to um, fruition, which. Um, often has her on really cool journeys around the world, exotic journeys. So, and uh, she has a very inspiring life story did behind this. Did she go to this. India? Did she Pardon? go to India? Yes, she did. And she okay. wrote a book too. Yeah. And we'll talk about that. And also she's having a, 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 an event coming up on July 29th, which is the Dare to Dream. Con it's a contest and an event together, and she'll tell you a little bit more about that. Great. Okay. And Good. I think that's the whole lineup for today. Well, here. you never know what else is going to happen, but we'll yeah, just keep it. If there are any surprises, uh, yeah. So we'll stay uh, glued to your computer. <laughs> Click us on and enjoy the next two hours. Absolutely. So let's take a quick break. Come back. We're going to come back with uh, you, Jeanette, and Mark, Mark Gordon, uh, and it's going to be the magnetic marketing moment with mm -hmm. your marketing magnet. Mm -hmm. And Mark and Gordon Mark of Gordon. Mark uh, of Forward Marketing. Okay. Quick break. We'll be right back. Look at launchthatchannel.com. <laughs> No. It's simple as ABCs, now you and me, black birds and bees, huh? now don't be scared, ain't trying to incarcerate you, huh. as a matter of fact, no contract, and satisfaction's never too high, uh, can't get big, baby, let me know what's your flavor, you're so sweet, I feel like a freak by nature, Caught up in you, girl. I just wanna say, yeah. So, baby, please, girl, don't tease. Already got me on my knees. Are you the one for me? Said you got what I need now. 
They so sexy, they knock me off my feet. Are you the one for me? I said you got what I need. Sexy lady, won't you be my? 